when uh, I was at ESPN and I was doing Sports Center on a Sunday with Hannah. And I used to do this segment about what are the players wearing. And I wasn't in the war room where they, um, you know, were all the producers who kind of prep the talent before they go on um, were sitting because I was obviously on camera. But I come back and an analyst, an NFL analyst goes, oh, God, Carrie, they were so upset that you did the segment on what the players are wearing. One producer said, I can't believe what we're turning into. We're doing fashion shows. We're talking about what the players are wearing, like so put out. And it's the it's that. It's that process, it's that thought process that we can't grow the game into different aspects, which yeah. keeps it so stale and keeps it yeah. exclusive. Right. And it's not fair because it's everybody's game. You can't profit off my likeness. And what I mean by my likeness is my blackness and then mm -hmm. be mad that I want to celebrate what it is yeah. and call it a wave, a part of the game that it's not. That's just not fair. That's not how this works. It's inclusive yeah. and, and and you can't and you can't do that. You can't live in that world. And what does the NBA become but a runway show pregame that's all it is now and the w now too you know that's all it is that's all they care about who has no. a line everybody got oh, a line. anybody under 30 cares about you know what i'm saying like i get it like it's not it doesn't have to be for me that you know what i yeah. mean like just understand it's everything's not for you you know they were and the, the commentators were like so angel has i guess that's her baby hair i'm like i can't don't worry about <laughs> <laughs>